also need to consult with the administration or the coordination or the department we're working in in this educational institution if it's allowed that we have a movie day because this means that you might actually try to uh, pause the curriculum for a while and do uh, this movie for one day and also try to make sure that they know the movie that you're going to uh, play and they are all okay with the theme so that it, you wouldn't be using something again as people's culture or beliefs uh, that might offend them some way. It would be really fun if the students are having a certain novel and you're bringing the movie of this novel to use inside the class. So this way it would be really nice, especially for the students who are having difficulty in reading. They will be watching the movie and it will make things a little bit more clearer to them. The last step that we have in this course is if you're going to use a cartoon movie, you need to make sure that this movie does not have any offensive hidden messages because it's not because it's an animation or a cartoon movie that doesn't mean it is always innocent. So make sure that you watch the movie carefully and make sure that there is nothing wrong with it uh, that the students might acquire. And also, uh, not all cartoon movies are suitable for beginners because Usually it is like made for um, old people and adults uh, or people from the, this native language. So what you can do here is just to choose a part of the movie that could be suitable to the beginners in your class or use a script with this part or just to try to bring a cartoon that is uh, made for any educational purposes for beginners in your class. In this crash course we talked about using movies inside the EFL class and we talked about some of the do's and don'ts you need to consider while you are trying to teach through a movie. Just make sure that you check our uh, course on how to teach listening because it's going to be very insightful for you while you are teaching movies and it will tell you about the steps you can use. Thank you so much. We would be very glad if you subscribe to our YouTube channel and like our Facebook page and send us any inquiries or questions that you have. Thank you and see you in the coming course.